Hey, interesting hunters. Hey, welcome back to Boring Charge 4, the thieves end. So in the last part, we kind of got to see how Nathan Drake has a little bit of a normal life. I mean, it's weird as shit, but you know, after the shit Drake's been through, I think he's earned a normal life. Basically, now we're basically in his office, sorta. I think maybe an attic office where there's a whole bunch of freaking Easter eggs. I mean, look at this. Look at this. See that? That's the snow. I mean, the snow jacket he wore on Charlie Two. But oh, oh, what's this? The statue from Uncharted 2 as well. Big brother some years back. Yeah, remember? He climbed the big thing and he had to, like, you know, move the arm to a certain position. That, that was so weird and stuff. Well, skull. Yee. One of the stranger things I've collected um, along the years. I guess this is Uncharted 1. I'm not sure, but, you know, we, we, we had a skull, so maybe if I hit another game, maybe. Oh, there's Bulb Machine or Bulb Maker. Oh, oh, oh. A Spanish doubloon found in a German U-boat. In the middle, in the middle of, the of the jungle. Who the fuck? Thunk. Yeah, and Chard 1, I think it's like chapter 4, I think. When you get in the German U-boat and discover, you know, more clues about the so El Dorado. Francis Drake takes a bullet for Sully. Uh, oh, oh, I remember that when you all think Sully, Sully's dead, but oh, turns out he's not us. dead. But yeah, so, me, Sully, and Elena. I like how, like, that, one thing I never got, can a, can a book like that really stop a bullet? I'm not, no, leave it in the comment section if you think it does. To, honestly, I don't think it does. I think a bullet will go right to the book. I honestly do. I think a bullet's much Shambhala. faster than that. Huh. Shambhala. You mean Uncharted 2? Miss you, pal. Yeah. Ten, I think it's in Tenzin, right? In Tenzin? Yeah, Tenzin! Oh, knew it. Wait, can I read it? Wait, I have to read it. I can read it? Hold up. It said read. I, I heard read. What was it? It was flip. Here, read. Nate and Tencent. Oh, okay. I already knew that. I wonder what Tencent's up to now. Put that down. What's, uh, what's this? So many men killed each other for a piece of this. Oh, look. look the weird resin thing from Uncharted 2. Said to give... What if I, if I shake it a lot? Well, like, press on fire. No. Look, I remember it lights on fire and it creates, like, a weird blue flame. That, like, the only thing that could have killed... Um, Lazarovich. And Francis and his elaborate puzzles. Oh, yeah. Uncharted 3 reference. Uh, this, basically, this was the whole, like, decoder thing that Nate put the ring in, and that decoded, like, the stuff that Drake was doing in weirdness of Drakeness. Oh, what's in this? And this must be Uncharted 4. This must be the notes. Nah. That must be his brother. You know, he doesn't want to bring back... Oh, okay, I get it. You don't bring back old memories. Yeah. Oh. Thanks for nothing, St. Dismas. Yes, St. Dismas. You know, you're gonna dance. Dance, St. Dismas, dance! You will do the Drake dance! Which, unfortunately, is just doing this in a circle, but still! It's dancing! I am pleased! Put you down. You're a devil dancing. You have pleased me, St. Dismas. I think I said your name wrong, but still... Why is there a lot? I just realized, why is there a lot of bubble makers? Like, is he, is he expecting to do some sort of giant bubble thing? Now, this was a crazy one. Ram of the Pillars, aka Uncharted 3. The Royal Inn. What? Mm. Nate. Another lifetime. How are things? I've been up to usual sh shit again. Nothing major. But enough to keep the heat on. Ugh, key on the wine stock. Wow. I'm not reading a shit today. Why? Caught wind of something sound over up your alley. Should you ever change your mind, give me a yell. I'm always a hand hand for a quick getaway. Love Chloe. So I guess this is the um uh, I guess this is the note that, you know, made Drake and Sully go to the What the fuck? Do you see all that art shit on the freaking screen? What the fuck? The fuck is this? The... Okay, I, I I hope that my PS4 glitching out and not watching actual... my style anymore. What the fuck? What the fuck is that? A belt buckle? Okay, belt, what, what, what target was that from? What the fuck? Yeah. A, a nerf gun? Are you fucking serious? The funny thing is I have that exact same nerf gun. Here they come. Take cover. I'm surrounded. Oh shit. We're surrounded. Okay. Get cover, get cover! Okay, where are they? Where are the ghosts? Die! Reload. Yeah. Right. Okay. Okay. Uh, uh, uh. Okay. 
Find them. Uh, 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 oh, yeah, team. Take that. Oh, I want them up there. He's sniping. Uh, Big bang. Big bang. Bang. There we go. Need to reload. Well, those what? That's what the things are for. Yeah, bring it. Where are they? They're around here. I smell a yeti. Yetis. I see one. Yeti. Eat plastic. Gotcha. Okay. Come on, Drake. We got this. Yeti. Yeti. Bang, bang. I got you. What? I got you for that. Oh. Yeah. Uh, um. Yeah, I'll be right there. Yeah. Uh, I'm just right there, honey. Just gonna. <laughs> just, just gonna put my um. Yeah, play time's yeah, over. Put that down. <laughs> Don't tell Elena I was playing the toy gun, okay? She would freaking flip. I don't know why she would flip, but just it would be weird. Oh, if you didn't know, Elena. Well, I'm pretty sure you you know now, but I think Elena and Drake are married now. Okay, I think at the end of Chart Three, that's where they're kind of like going at. That they're kind they kind of got married because we, we all know ooh, we all know they have a nice love triangle. They had yeah, like a nice romance. It was, it was worth it. It was, it was uh, romantical. Okay, wait right there, honey. I'm gonna explore my shit. I'm gonna explore my house. Yeah, I'm pretty sure I explored a million times already, but I'm still exploring it. Fuck. Wow, we really need to go on another vacation. Wow. Oh. Too long. So I guess these aren't from a charter. I guess that's from like another you know, normal life vacation thing. Okay. What's this? Oh, is this what you're working on? Bangkok Travel Guide. The ultimate traveler's guide info guide. Safe and easy trips. Yeah. Okay. Full color maps. Boring. I don't plan on going to Bangkok anytime soon, so I think you gotta leave that right there for the bathroom. Oh, look at that sexy devil in the mirror. Look at that sexy devil! Right, no, no, enough with your ego, Drake. Enough with your ego. Let's, let's go. Drake, you and your duck ego. You're not, oh, is this a kid? <gasps> do we have a kid? Do we have a son? Oh, no, it's an hour. Oh. I was like, do we have a kid? Why, why, why did I immediately assume that Drake had a son? Why? Sequels. That's why. Or or, or it could be like a... You know, that'd be kind of a cool lead. You know, like a female lead in a charity game. Oh, wait. No, I just realized. No, because that would be a little bit too much like Tomb Raider. <laughs> oh, so this is a wedding. So that must be Chloe. There's Sully. Wow. Wow. Aww, so adorable. That is a good one. Yeah. That, okay, that is a good romantic picture. Why does it that Elena looks like my teacher, like a little bit? That, that, that why is that weird? My teacher, my my teacher looks slightly like a like Elena, and that freaks me out. That boy, what if my teacher was wow a walking closet? Damn, Drake, you're rich as fuck! Well, given the fact that you, like, basically found all shit ton of gold and treasure hunters and all that shit, I'm pretty sure you'd be a very wealthy man. But it's still weird that I find that Lena looks very similar to my teacher. That's, that's kind of weird. I can't look my teacher anymore and not think of Lena. I'm like, hey, how's Drake doing? Why do we have three bathrooms? I'm just, I, I, I don't find a reason for three you bathrooms. Were up there a long time. Well, I was researching something. Yeah, researching. Oh, is that what we're calling it these days? I was. Yeah. Hey, would you mind grabbing the food? I'm just wrapping up here. No. Yeah, sure thing. Thanks. So what's the food again? The spicy dumplings? So... Oh, is this food? Oh, no, here it is. Bowl. I can take it with you, Drake? Jeez. You couldn't put it on your arm? Oh, no, it'll spill. Oh, pff, I'm stupid. Dinner is served, Elena. There you go. <laughs> Done. Okay. Oh. You finish it? Yeah. Oh. You know, it's probably too long and full of typos, but that's what editors are for, right? <laughs> God, I'm starving. It looks good. Mm-hmm. So, how was your day? What? Hmm? Huh? We got none of that. Oh, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. How was your day? Oh, it was fine. Mm hmm Typical day in paradise. Mm hmm I, uh, I got to pull a bunch of garbage out of a river. Mm. Yes. At least you got to go for a swim. <laughs> Did you find any exciting garbage? Oh, some 
Brilliant stuff. It was a um, early 21st century truck we got. <laughs> Apparently, the natives called it a semi. Oh, dear Lord. Kind of stuff. So, it, the boring stuff. Tell me about the article. Well, it started out as this fluff piece about tourism in Bangkok, but I don't think the magazine is going to like the angle that I'm taking because everyone immediately commented about how rude the smog was, that it was like shock to the lungs, like the second that you got off the plane. So, kind of took this U-turn and this L-turn. Um, this is ah! What? Where are you? I'm in here, being stabbed with a fork. <laughs> Oh, really? What? Just keep going. It was, it was interesting. Oh. Yeah. Interesting. What's my article about? What? This one? Mm-hmm. Oh, shit. After the choices. Um, hmm. Let's see. The flight in Bangkok. No, wait. People of Bangkok. Uh, the people of, of uh, Bangkok. And, and the smog and how they, yeah. they can't uh, yeah I know my shit flight anywhere I know my I'm, I'll listen later can't breathe I'll listen later wow All right, I'm sorry no it was valiant it I was, was in the really ballpark right in a different state but yeah you were in a ballpark <laughs> Jameson asked you about that Malaysia job again Jameson always asked me about the Malaysia job look Nate I really think that you should take it You know what? I don't want it. Really? I mean, he doesn't have the permits. And we agreed we're not going to take that kind of work anymore. It's okay, just not worth it. it. It doesn't sound that risky. All right? If it's just a permit. No way. You could call Sullivan. You haven't seen him Elena, in about two years. Look, could we please drop this? Okay, I just don't want you to not take it because of me. I'm not taking it because of me, okay? <laughs> I appreciate the gesture. It's just... I'm gonna go ahead and do the dishes. Oh, stop, I'll do them. No, you on. did them last night. No, you cooked. I clean. It's fine. I mean, at least, at least, uh, let me, let me try to earn it or, or something. Let me, um, play you for it. You'll play me for yeah, it? Yeah, 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 your little TV game thing. I bet I can beat your high score. You think that you can beat my high score on my TV game thing? Yeah, I think you're scared now. You don't even know what it's called. I don't need to know what it's <laughs> called. I've seen you play. It's right. jumping and running, and I have a natural talent oh, for that. Really? So what do you say, chicken? Is it a bet? Oh, wow. OK, cowboy. Is that a fucking PF1? Oh, I'm learning. No, that fucking PS1. Oh my gosh! Oh my gosh! Now he flashbacks. Is this it? Oh my gosh! No, it has to load. Load. Oh my gosh! Man, what's your place? This is taking a really long time. Holy you have shit. no patience. When you turn something on, you expect it. Oh to my gosh! <gasps> <laughs> the start button. Oh my god. Oh, all right, I got it. I'm, I'm sorry, I normally don't talk during okay. cutscenes, so but... So you want to run towards oh the camera. Oh my gosh. Run to the camera. Got it. Oh my god! Oh my god! I got it! 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 Oh my god! Oh my god! I remember this! The boulder gonna come down! Wait, I got a fruit, and the boulder comes down, and you gotta run from it, and then there's like a pit, like one pit, I think. Just run away from yeah, there's one pit here. No, two pits, two pits. And then it gets... Use your spin attack. And then another one comes down. Right? I'm missing a lot of fruit. Yeah. 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 And then I remember, there's like, in the up next one, there is a, um... What was it? There's like another pit. Okay, smash the box. Oh shit! I've been playing. I haven't played this game in over like ten years. Okay. It's just what he does. 
Yeah, it's not very realistic. Oh, uh, uh, that's a checkpoint, and then graphics are pretty good. Yeah, yeah, and then there's like a but there's like a pit with like another like thing in there. Like, I gotta, yeah, yeah, jump on them, jump on the pit, douche, douche. Oh my gosh, that was Oh my god, I remember this would be my favorite game when I was so little. Like, I would love, I like, I would literally run home from school just to play this. It was so like, I remember playing every Crash Band. Oh shit! Stop yelling. I'm encouraging a coach. Oh! Whatever. You fell in the pit. I don't know. Oh, they, they did the whole crash bandicoot thing where you turn to like a, like, um. I, I would have climbed. Turn to like an angel. You should learn to climb. Climbing's always helped me. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, Drake always helped me. But oh my. Good, good. good. There you go. Okay, grab the fruit. What is the fruit? They, yeah, 100 pieces of extra life. 100? Who's got time to pick 100 pieces of fruit? Crash bandicoot does. I no, no, I remember that um weird totem thing that you have. That's oh shit, shit. The weird to ah. Bandicoot. I'm e even now, okay, even now, okay. When I was little, I could never like, I could never get past the first section without dying. Even even now, I can't get past it without dying. That was that was not too bad. What? I wanted to be then I'll be so happy if you if you literally Foxes do not play and cut the entire Crash Bandicoot. I don't care if it's like all of them. If it's just the very first Crash Bandicoot, I'll be completely happy. I would I, I, I would be satisfied. I would officially make this the best game ever if I could literally play the entire Crash Bandicoot. Oh yeah! Steady boy still got it! Damn. Did I beat it? Did I beat it? Fuck. What? Is that it? You asked for it. Oh. You gotta be kidding me. I practically had it. You can give it another shot. Come on, double or nothing. My car could really use a good cleaning. Really? really? You're gonna start yeah. the smack talk There's now? There's this mode called easy mode. I just switch it. Wow. It's way no, easier on no, me. Just keep mode. talking. Keep talking. What are you gonna do? I'm, I'm warning. What are you gonna do? I'm warning. In real life, what hey, can you do? I'm Show me. You. What can you I'm do in real you. life? What do you think about that? <laughs> <laughs> hey, are you happy? Yeah, of course. You? Um. Um? <laughs> really? Come here. Not open yet. We're closed. Come on, man. All right, I'm coming. Coming. Asshole. <sighs> yeah, can I help you? Yeah, I'm uh, looking for my little brother. It's about your height, a little bit leaner. Definitely less gray in the temples. Sam? It's good to see you again, Nathan. God, Sam. Oh, all right, all right, all right. Take it easy, take it easy. <laughs> <laughs> How? How? I thought you... I saw you get shot. Yes, you did. Right there. Huh? Jesus. <laughs> well, the doctors, they... I mean, doctors, they patched me up and they... tossed me right back into the cell. Yeah, but I, I made calls. I, I checked everywhere. I, everything I heard, everything I found, it, it all confirmed you were dead. Well, Nathan, we killed a guard, okay? So they wanted to see me rot in that cell for the rest of my life, and I nearly did. He's a Sam, I... Man, if I had known, I, I, I swear to you, I would have you come back. You would have come back. I know, Nathan, I know. What's important now, though, is that I'm out. Hey, hey, you still with me? I need some air. You're not gonna pass out on me or nothing, I, are you? I just might. It's a lot to digest, you know? 
But how, how did you get out? When did you get out? How, how'd you even get here? Find me. All right, right, right. Slow down. Hey. Have a seat. Hey. I want to hear about you. Huh? Me? Yeah. What's to tell? Well, call some of your old contacts. Tell me some pretty crazy ass stories. <laughs> These were crazy stories. Got shot, hanging from a derailed train in the Himalayas. Yeah, that uh, that actually happened. Come on, man, what did I miss? Jesus, damn, where do I start? Start with the best part. Okay. Um. Uh, do you remember the theory that we had that Sir Francis Drake faked his own death? Yeah, sure. Okay, he did. I found the coffin. Off the coast of Panama? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> All right, now, get this. Okay, I open it up, right? right? And there's no body. But the bottom is his old journal. Are you shitting me? I mean, what can I say? Another lost city destroyed, and uh, we made it out alive. Barely. <sighs> Unbelievable. Yeah. Yeah, it was. I wish you could have been there. No, it, it's literally unbelievable. You, you tell me you stumble upon yet another archaeological <laughs> gold mine, and somehow you manage to walk away with nothing. Yeah, well, it's a story of my life, I guess. But, you know, I managed to grab a few trinkets here and there. Mm. Paid off the car, the house, the engagement ring. The engagement ring? I'm married. I can't believe uh, Elena from the stories. That's my wife. You gotta come meet her tonight. Dinner at my place. You're coming to dinner. I can tell her all about you. Shit, I gotta tell her all about you, Nathan. I'm in a lot of trouble here. What? What are you talking about? What kind of trouble? Is the name Hector Alcazar ring about with you? Yeah, he's the, the drug lord. Mm -hmm. Butcher of Panama, right? Why? It's a funny story, but uh, last year he was my cellmate. So this is how I got out of prison. You're not reading the night. Samuel, come here. Listen. The guards, they're singing. Eh, well, they're probably drunk. Perhaps. But they are content. How can they be content with their small lives? Their miserable jobs? <laughs> well, I mean... They have wives to go home to. What do we got? Huh? No offense. We have ambition. No. <laughs> and when we get out of here, that ambition will take us to places these idiots cannot even imagine. Yeah, well, amen to your optimism. <sighs> what will you do when you get out, Samuel? <laughs> That's if I get out of here. I'm sure you can imagine. I can. But I want to hear you say it. I will find the greatest pirate treasure of all time. Which I am sure you are sick of hearing about by now. Oh, no. The tale of Henry Avery and his 400 million in jewels and gold has... become a sweet lullaby for me. Do you really think you can find it? Given the opportunity? Absolutely. <laughs> Ambition. What is that Avery quote? <laughs> I am a man of fortune, and I must seek my fortune. Mm. I like how he thinks. What the hell was that? <laughs> the opportunity of a lifetime. Señor Alcázar, un gusto verlo. Segmenta key. Oh. ¿Qué hacemos con él? 
Samuel, are you ready to seek your fortune? Yeah. Vamanos. Oh, shit. Hector, oh, my God. We're gonna try to freaking jail for a picky. Basically, escaping from jail a second time. Holy shit, but we gotta do that next part, guys. So, we come back and we're escaping jail just as Samuel. And maybe just have a little less guard killing. So, thank you all for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. I'll be seeing you all in the next Uncharted. Uncharted. Uncharted part. Peace out, y'all. Oh, <laughs> <laughs>